Bible says, consider it pure joy when you face trials of many kinds. Either that's the most stupid scripture in the Bible, or there's something about it. Coming up next on Pastor Bob Daly. Consider it pure joy when you face trials of many kinds because you know the testing of your faith develops perseverance. And perseverance must finish its work so that you're mature and complete and not lacking in anything. Well, that's important, isn't it? And you see, folks, the Bible says that not only are you going to get through the trial, but there's pure joy on the other side. Why? Because of three things. You're mature, you're complete, and you're not lacking in anything. But what does it take to get there? You know, when we're in the middle of a trial, all we want to do is get through it. All we want to do is get to the other end. And of course, that's how we always feel, and you're going to continue to feel that way. But the truth of the matter is, there is so much to learn in the middle of the trial. God has some amazing things to share with you. Some amazing things to learn. Not only do you learn how to trust in Him and depend on Him, but you learn a lot of things about trials and a lot of things about life itself. Consider it pure joy when you face trials of many kinds because you know the testing of your faith develops perseverance perseverance. In other words, you have to get through it. That's what the testing of your faith is all about. Keep going, keep persevering. He says because persevering this much, you must finish its work. In other words, you need to continue to persevere. Don't quit before it's done. Consider it pure joy when you face trials of many kinds because you know the testing of your faith develops perseverance and perseverance must finish its work so that you're mature and complete and not lacking in anything. Keep going. <laughs> God bless you. Have a great day.